Hi, today I want to show you what's included with the Genos 2 when we sell it. So the Genos 2 is the most fabulous instrument, loads of things built into it from Yamaha, but it, it doesn't actually come with registrations and it doesn't really come with anything extra when you buy it to help set it all up. So what we're going to do, whenever we sell one, we're going to load it up with lots of extra uh, registrations, more styles, more voices, more playlists, and that will make it much more exciting to play and give you much more help when you're going to set up all the different sections. Okay, so let's start off with these registration buttons. These are the key to most of your settings and registrations that we're going to load in to the instrument for you. If you press these two black ones together, the registration back plus and minus select buttons, and just arrow back up till you get to the top of the, the pages, you'll see we've got uh, user on the top and user on the left. And although we've put everything into a, a memory stick, it's all accessible through the user area of the keyboard. Now they're set up into different types of titles. The Tyros 5 Music Finder, many of you will be familiar with from using on the Tyros before. The Music Finder bonus songs are extra songs that we've now got available to us. And um, the Genos 2 Music Finder will be all of the songs from the playlist area that we've got from Yamaha to load in. So if we start off with that, We've got the, um, the equivalent of song titles, but they're in categories. So we could go into Latin and we've got pages and pages of Latin songs that we might want to set up. And when we select a song, it will give us uh, up to seven different buttons lit up. Some of them are going to give you an intro or an ending. And in between, you've got the, the variations uh, using the variations from the ABCD buttons uh, with the one touch settings. So you get in the the sounds that suit that style very well. If we come back from there, you'll see there's two uh, pages, 15 categories altogether of different styles of music. And each of those, if we go into ballroom and we choose, let's have a look what we've got here. Um, page two, there's Blue Moon, Begin the Begin, Brazil. So all the popular songs are in there, uh, Chicago. And um, we can choose a song and we can um, get it to give us all these uh, parts of the registration. So if we go to, let's go to number two, we'll just go to um, Blue Moon. There we go. Six different variations. So number one gives us the intro. Two is the first backing sound without any intros cutting in. Three is uh, B, four is D, uh, C, five is D, and then six gives you the ending. So if I play with number one first, it gives me the intro setup, gives me synchro start, and we play our first chord. New style. Let's go to the second sound. song and I didn't want that intro to cut in I can press number two and it'll give me the first sound but without the intro attached sounds built into all the different sections and we've been using uh, one of them called um, so let's go back to the beginning of it we've got um, that was the Genos 2 music finder now the music finder of bonus songs is another I think it's something like uh, 400 different extra songs and these are all 
in here with the titles uh, showing on here. And these are a collection of, of songs which are in another part of the instrument. I'll show you in a moment. Now then, we've got things like Autumn Leaves, and they're all alphabetical to find. If we go back up again, we've got the Tyros 5 Music Finder. Many of you will be familiar with all these songs, starting with Abandon. Now, the difference with the ones from the Tyros 5 is they won't give you the six lights. They'll only give you one. So if I go to A Hard Day's Night, just the one light comes on. We have to remember to select it for it to actually work. So you might think, oh, I've chosen it now. But you have to press the light. It comes on. Synchro start and the indo in introduction as well. So A Hard Day's Night, let's try it. <laughs> variations on the sounds as long as the OTS link button is turned on but we get them by going through the A, B, C or D buttons and that will change so we can still get the same thing without all of the extra lights showing on the panel here so they're the music finder songs from Tyros 5 and there's 1825 to choose from so we've got um, all of the 1825 we've got Loads in the music, but I think there's 450 in here. We've got another 500 in the bonus songs. And the bonus songs is using what we've got in these next categories. And this is the decades. Um, we've got Bacharach, we've got Beatles, we've got Bossa Novas. And we split them all up into categories so that you can find them. 70s, 50s, 40s. And then we've got the last letters uh, on here. So what we can do in the decade series, you can see they're listed as a a title only we haven't got the name of the song to be able to search for it but we can find songs so if we go into let's go into 60s so you've got 10 lights coming on and we can go into menu again and go into registration bank info and we'll see on here all of the songs in the area there so we've got uh, wheels downtown let's try downtown let's play a, uh, a first call to hear the intro this is it tells you a suggestion of the key that it was originally written in. So downtown in E. Brilliant backing. Oh, we're into it. I kind of recognise it, can't you? If we go into, um, there's a kind of hush. Let's play the first chord. Suggest it in the key of C. Look, there's a C after it. Let's play my chord. Really well orchestrated backing. playing the song so we've got all of these song titles we've got the a b c d variation still and they'll link up to the ots the one touch settings okay let's just come out of there for a moment let's go into another one let's go into uh, let's go into the 80s and again we go to menu registration bank info and we've got all these uh, settings down the left hand side for 10 different songs if we go to madness our house look i'll play it says a suggestion of key of c another one they're so good they're using all the new styles and they're very well orchestrated let's go to um, woman in love let's play the first chord <laughs> you get the gist of it guys some really good settings and i would welcome you to get in there and have a good old go on those now if you wanted to find a song from any of those music finder type settings, we've now got this search button. Go to the search, we can click on the black box and a typewriter comes up. So if we wanted to find, we'll just do Blue Moon because that was one we did earlier. B L U E M O O N. In fact, I've left the gap out, so let's do that. I'll just put blue in for now. Okay. And this will help us to find a song we might be looking for. So we've got Blue Bossa, Blue Christmas. Blue Moon of Ten Kentucky, uh, Blue Suede Shoes. If we go to page two, we've got more. Because um, we've got so many songs now listed in. Blueberry Hill, um, Blue Bayo, Blue Eyes, Blue Moon. There we go. So we can select Blue Moon and we've got the light come on ready to select. And then we can start playing. So if you want to search for your own song, just go into the magnifying glass at the top here. And then we can go into uh, this black box. 
delete the letters that you searched for last time. If we put in, um, let's put in love. I bet there's lots of songs with love in the title. Yeah, pages of them, look. And I love her. Don't throw your love away. Uh, all you need is love. So there's lots and lots. There's actually 20 different pages with songs with love in the title. Okay, so lots lots in there to choose and to find. Uh, and they're all in the, the user area. And remember this little arrow in the bottom corner takes you back up to that top level where everything's listed. So if we go into the um, the registration ones this time, we've got Genos 1 registrations and Genos 2 uh, tips to registration. Let's go into number 2 and we've got our categories. Now the difference with these is they're just the sounds but they're not related to a particular song. So in each of these we can use this menu button again. Let's go up to menu and go to registration bank info and you'll see that we have a name for each of the 10 buttons that we might select. Now these have all got a different speed attached to them, look 66, 72, 90. And there's a little trick we can do here. We can use the freeze button down at the front here to lock in the speed of one of the ones that you start with, which means you can use all the other sounds, but the, the accompaniment section will all stay exactly the same. Let's just check that it's set correctly. So we can press this direct access button. Okay. And then we can choose the freeze button and on the screen now you can see what the screen uh, what the freeze button is going to do it's going to freeze the tempo the style the multi pads and the foot pedals you can tick other boxes too but that's essentially what we need it to hold on for us and then just exit out again now when we use the freeze button now it will keep the style and the speed all the same but the sound from these buttons will change so we can we can use each button as the starting point and then we can use the other buttons while the freeze is on to get a different sound so let's show you we're going to number one which is miller saxophones number 66 i'm going to turn on my freeze button and now when i play it will lock in that speed and that accompaniment idea of it we use the freeze button whichever one you started on and press the freeze button it locks in that left hand so if we go to turn it off for a sec and we'll choose um let's have a look we've got um number 200 full saxophones so i'll go number 10 which is 200 full saxophones press the freeze button and i'll play my chord it's a fast one now we can use any of the voices the sounds now but it's keeping it on the first setting that I use so it just gives you the option of 10 variations rather than one per speed if we come out of that one let's go into Latin and again we'll see what we've got to choose from menu and bank info and these are again all of our different Latin backings from gentle to smooth to strings to mandolin so if I go to my mandolin bossa nova let's play a chord and see what it sounds like I'm going to press my freeze button. Ah, Cardinal's going to didn't turn it off and press it. Okay, so now press it. There we go. I'm going to press my freeze button now. That keeps the speed the same.
enter any of the variations manually and change them. So I could have used the break or more intros or variations, but essentially while I'm going through it will keep the backing the same speed and the same backing so that I can use the other variations. So that's a, a useful thing to try. We've got some other stuff. We've got theatre organs. Look, if I go into one of the theatres. So have a fiddle around and go through all these. You're going to get some great settings. And this is still in the registration area. Now, what you have to remember, if we're using registrations and settings for the whole instrument, you go into it through these two black ones. But we've loaded other stuff in there for you too. And these include uh, expansion voices and expansion um, styles. So the expansion voices can be found from the, um, the voice buttons on the pictures and expansion styles can be from the style section you've got to remember whatever you're going into you've got to go in through the right door so if it's registrations these two buttons will bring us in we could have gone from the screen into the registration area if it's going to be the voices go on to um, one of the pictures and then we go into the user area and then we go to expansion and these are essentially about another 900 extra voices that weren't in the genus from the factory but we've downloaded and loaded up for you the, um, the, the extra expansion packs. And these include uh, 22 expansion packs, each with lots more voices or styles. So let's go into the best of Europe. We've got in here another um, 50 different voices. And they include basses, baran stick sounds. They include um, flamenco saxophones, uh, wood flutes and accordions so all of all these are extra voices that you can select if we come back out of that one let's go into a different pack let's go into choir and vocals these are going to give us extra vocal sounds <laughs> so lots to fiddle with if we come back out again and we go into entertainer these are going to give us extra voices and sounds that we can use. What's this jodel? <laughs> Yodeling sound. That's great. <laughs> so there's lots of extra voices in there because we're in the voice section and we're in uh, the right one voice in the expansion pack user area. Let's come back up again. Now then, these are all your expansion packs and there's something like 900 extra voices because we're in the voice section. Exit back out again, and let's go in this time to the um, the orange section, which is the style section. Now again, we've got the user area for our expansion packs, but we've loaded something else into here for you. We've loaded in 234 extra styles, and these were styles which were in Taurus 5, but they didn't get included in Genos. So we've loaded them back in, and they're available here for you. Lots of styles, so there's lots to choose from. And then the expansion pack in the style section gives us the same titles that we had a minute ago. So we've still got the best of Europe, but this time it won't have um, voices, it'll have styles. So we've got um, waltzes, we've got uh, pizzica, tangos, swing, and there's again five pages with gypsy slow look. So we've got lots of choice again, but these are styles. So we've got to remember what we're searching for. If it's a style, we go into it through the style area, keep it orange. If it's a, a voice, it'll be through the blue voice section, and then we know where we are. So remember, go into the section, go to user, and then go into expansion for the extra expansion voices, which are all in these packs. And if we come back out to user, we've got the extra Tyros 5 styles. What you can also do is search for a style or a voice by going into the right section on the screen. Now, this is where some people get mixed up. So if we want to find a style, Go into the style section and then um, we can go to this search magnifying glass. 
it shows us at the moment all the different categories, but we can find just the ones with the title that has the word we search for. So let's go to search, and then let's go to this black box here and type in the name that we want to search for. Let's put in ballad, B-A-L-L-A-D. Okay, and now we can see all the ballads that are in the style section. This will include expansion styles, user styles, and presets. So we've got five pages of 10, 10 pages of 10, 15, there's 18 pages. So we've got 173 different ballad type styles. That's great. Um, we can clear that and we could search again. Let's press that back box and then we could put in maybe uh, rock. And we can see then we've got 5, 10, 15, 16 pages of rock. Um, or you could just put in um, flamenco or something and see if, if something suits the style of music you want to play. Yeah, we've got uh, seven flamenco ones. Look, so that's a really good way to search. Now we can do the same principle of searching in these blue areas. We can go to one of the voice sections. Again, go to the search and then we can get to the black box and we could type in a voice. We might want the, um, let's put in oboe. Okay, and that will show us we've got uh, 16 different oboes to select from. So that's a really good way to find um, a certain type of sound or style in that particular section. But make sure you're looking in the right area for that. So the other feature that's really good to be able to use is this demo button. If we go to a, a particular sound and we're not quite sure how to use it, let's, let's jazz uh, Casotto. So it's, uh, it's going to show us any sound and kind of the way that you might want to finger the notes on the keyboard to get the best effects. If we go to electric guitar, we go to the shadow sound. Fantastic. Let's try the choirs. These are nice. So let's go to boys choir R demo. Great. So any of the voices in any of the sections, we can just press this demo and it will give us a little uh, rendition of how that sound could be used. Now, the playlist feature is one which a lot of people have confusion about. So we've got the registration area using the, the buttons at the front here, which give you all the different registrations. But also they're giving us the song titles now. So whereas we used to go into Music Finder on a Tyros 1, 2, 3, 4 or 5, um, all of the song titles now are using one batch of registrations, these batch of up to 10. So very often the ones from the Taurus 5 are only going to give us one light. We turn it on and that sets it all up for us. Now, the playlist feature is a little bit different. What it does is it uses the song titles in the registration area and makes a list out of it, collates them into a list. So if we go to the playlist feature and we go into this top box at the top here, might want to come a bit closer to this video. So we pressed playlist, we come into this box here and we can come back and see that there are different playlists. We've got a, a Genos 2 playlist, we've got a Tyros 5 playlist and, and this will show us a bit like the music finder on the Tyros 5. We can select it till it goes white, press the X and we've got the list starting with a banda that you'll be with uh, familiar with. Now that's fine but these aren't separate files, these are using all the files from the registration area. So you have to remember these are just someone's put them together and use them as a playlist, um, but all of the files are kept still in the registration button and the registration bank area. So to select a song that we found in the playlist area, we can either hit the tick and it comes straight on, or we can touch the title and then press it a second time and it selects it. Hit the tick, it goes straight on, or hit the title, and we have to hit it twice. So it sort of puts it in standby mode and then we touch it again to actually get it set up. So what we have to remember, these are lists of songs 
put together, but they're using all of the files um, from the registration area. So if I wanted to go into the, some of the new ones, let's just go back again. We'll go to the playlist feature. We're going to go to this box at the top of the screen and we're going to choose, in this case, I'm going to choose Genos new playlist. And we've got 15 categories. We've got 10 on the first page and another five. So if I wanted to go into pop, I select it a second time and then I press the X. And then we've got our list of songs and I can select one straight away from the tick. And you'll see these later ones are going to give us all six registration buttons. Whereas if we went to one of the ones from, let's say, the Tyros 5 list. So on page two, Tyros 5, and I select one of these. Only one light comes on. And that's where you need to make sure that you use the um, one touch setting link. So just coming over to the left hand side a minute. We've got the OTS link and that needs to be on to get the best benefits of the Tyros 5 music finder. Because you're only getting one button, that means that you, the A, B, C, D will give us variations on the sounds. So on the, um, the, the six lights here, we can get all of the variations on the newer ones from the Genos um, playlist. But on the Tyros 5 music finder ones, that's where we'll use the OTS link from the, the single ones. I'll just summarise what I've been showing you. This is all the stuff that we're including at ePianos in a Genos 2. You've got your expansion packs, there's uh, 22 to choose from, and they're all going to give you a selection of voices and a selection of styles. But remember to go into the right area. If it's a style, go in through the orange section. If it's a voice, go in through the blue section. We're also going to include the uh, registrations, and the registrations are found by pressing these two registration bank buttons and then make sure you're in the user area, arrow to the top and you've got all the titles. And those registration areas also include all the songs. So there's over two and a half thousand uh, song setups for easy setups for songs which you can then pick and you can go into the different variations and the different sounds through the uh, OTS for one touch setting link. Um, so lots and lots of content that we've made it um, loaded in before you get it to make it really easy to use. And of course we've got our helpline, you're more welcome to call us or email us for help in understanding certain parts of it. So we're a good choice. Come to ePianos for your Genos 2 and all those things will be ready in yours to enjoy. <laughs>